right so we got a couple actually three events today to check out with the pig there's going to be a swap meet and kind of car show i guess out by the flea market then i'm going to go to a dyno event i think it's like 40 bucks for two pulls or three pulls something i've got the flyer in my phone but there's going to be a bunch of cars obviously getting dynoed and then at around 2 p.m they're having an all night racing event. I'm not really sure what that means. I guess nationwide car meets, car insurance, whatever. They put on a car meet in Denver pretty much every Saturday night, Sunday night, whatever. But this Saturday, I guess they're doing some kind of all night drag racing and uh, go-kart and driving event at the uh, Pikes Peak Raceway. So I'm gonna check them all out. Hopefully they are all good turnouts and we'll see what happens. <laughs> All right, so that was the first swap meet. I guess they're just trying to advertise for their drift company, drift garage, whatever. So not a big turnout. I didn't expect much, it's Colorado Springs. I think there'll be a lot more people at the second event because of the $40 pulls on the dyno. So hopefully we'll get a little bit better footage from that. I need to find a restroom, I have to piss. I maybe get some lunch, so we'll see. So I got here a little early to the dyno event at Dino Jet, and I'm not too convinced when the entire parking lot is full of Honda Civics. Not sure how fun this is gonna be, but we'll see. Got another probably 30 minutes before the event starts. Here comes a beast of a red Civic. Eh, might be a lot of four banger action today, so we'll see. A lot of Hondas, but that's pretty cool. Looks like they're gonna have a pretty good event. Maybe that's why everybody wasn't at the swap meet earlier. Hopefully we'll see some badass cars do some pulls. Maybe even see some blow up. Trying to get access to the ECU or something, or huh? trying to get access to the plugs, or We're trying to get access to the ignition uh, wires. Oh, I got you. That way we can get RPM signal. Ah, I see. So that's just a cover. Yeah, just to cover all the smart. Gotcha, gotcha. Got so technical.
97 torque. Oof. That was pretty fun. Uh, I got to see some cool stuff on the dyno. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Now I'm headed to the south side to the Pikes Peak International Raceway and hopefully we can get some good shots there. Apparently there's some go-karts, maybe some drifting. I know they said they're going to have some 8 mile drag racing. So let's see what happens. exactly is supposed to be happening here at the track today it says eighth mile drags after party side by side circle drags autocross time attack and a drift demonstration so it says it also starts at 2 p.m. and it is now 357 so apparently it's been going for two hours and uh, I don't really see any action. The drift guys are just barely unloading their cars. There's a bunch of spectators. You can tell by the All orange right, wristband. And oh. Once again, welcome to Pikes Peak International Raceway. The nationwide overnight event. The track will be going hot on the early with guys like Jeff Hunter, Jeff Hunter, Sounds like it's going to be going at least until about 8 o'clock tonight. We're saying the half mile circle track is getting set up now and then the drift demonstration will be after that. And then the go-karts are going the whole time. So we may walk around and check it out. So far pretty boring.
pretty eventful day. I'm probably gonna head out early. It's going all night type event. So they've got go-karts starting soon. They've got drag racing around half of the oval track. Time trials on the center. They're gonna have some kind of drift demonstration on the center track here in the infield. So it's a lot of stuff, but it is going to be all night. I've been up since 8 a.m going around all these different events and stuff. It was a pretty eventful day. It's not, not as big of a turnout as I had hoped, but the turnout that I expected for Colorado Springs. I'm real shocked that actually this many people showed up. So it was fun otherwise, had a good time, met a lot of cool people, got a free t-shirt. So it looks like the drift team is about to start uh, getting ready to do their demonstration. It's getting a little cold out weather's starting to get cloudy so probably gonna wrap it up here guys be sure to like if you liked subscribe if you want and as always keep modding